How was it, was it to just get back in the win column after last night? Uh, I just took away that we got a lock in uh, for the start of the half. Uh, we let them come back to like a three point down three. Uh, so we just need a lock in. So, I mean, we can put them away sooner. Darvin mentioned that, just spoke, speaking with him, he mentioned that, you know, there's some slippage here and there. What were you guys seeing out there that you guys either weren't doing well or the Spurs were doing well that allowed them to stay in the game the way they did? They're well coached, so they're going to they're gonna continue to, to do what they're supposed to do. You know, it's never over against the Spurs. So I think keeping that mentality for 48 minutes allowed us to um, keep the league and continue to fight, too, when they, when they, when they claw back. So that's it. I say thank you. <laughs> Go again. Um, you guys have you faced Wimbanyama a couple times already this season, but even with that, you know, he's had a five by five tonight. Just what have you seen him or have you seen him evolve from those early season matchups in December to now? I mean, shoot. Whenever you have somebody like that size and that skilled, I mean, they're always down or bound to do something really well. And I mean, he's definitely come a long way. I feel like since we saw him at the beginning of the year, uh, he's playing with like a lot more balance. And I mean, he's just attacking the oak glass more. So I mean, he's coming. I mean, he's going to be real good. D'Lo, uh, this point last year when you guys had 24, 25 games left, you go on that run, then all leads to the Western Conference Finals. Now the break's over. What are you guys talking about these final 24, 25 games to, to get you where you want to go in your, your journey? Um, I think we never talked about it last year. We just kind of played one game at a time. Um, and we were clicking as well. So for, and for us, it made it easy for any individual to kind of, I don't know, capitalize the game, you know? Um, I just remember Vando winning games at that time. Rui was winning, ga winning games, AR. Brian, AD, obviously myself. Everybody brought um, brought their hard hats in and, and, and felt like they were a part of it. So I think that's where we're at now. A lot of guys are coming back from injury, but as a whole, the guys that are playing, you know, feel like you know we were something's brewing. Sure. You guys have a tough couple of matchups coming up. What's on your game plan for keeping this rolling, finding consistency, and just finding consistency within yourselves, and then. Just as a team. Uh, I mean, I don't know who we play, um, but I know, like I said, just the one game mentality, one game at a time mentality. Uh, we've beat some of the best teams, we lost to the teams that aren't the best. So, just coming knowing that you know it's about us, focusing on us, preparing ourselves for each game. I think we'll be all right. Um, we'll look up, and it'll be ten games left. You know, so just locking in. Thanks, guys. Thank you. <laughs>